the warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. And here we have Real Madrid against Espanyol. This is Peter Drury and I'm happy to inform you that Jim Beglin has joined me to offer his expertise. Well, thank you very much, Mr Drury, and hello to everyone. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Pushes it out wide. He's made sure that that won't get through. And back to the keeper. It's gone out for a throw in. That's a throw. Dada. Porsche. And the defence can get it clear. Aim forward. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? It's a loose ball. The worst cross in the world, but still room for improvement. Piatti. Deftly done. Away from immediate danger. Oh, try as they might, they just couldn't get into an attacking area. Modric. That was good pressing, forced the error to put an end to it before things could get even more threatening. It's Marcelo. Can he put it away? Oh, surely that deserved better. I think there's always that danger that the defence can get exploited in that way. That must have served as a real wake-up call to them. Oscar. Dardell. A goal now would certainly liven things up. Kroos gets it back. Passes it through. Time whistle goes. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Well, they've never really been threatened in the first half. I think it's been a magnificent team effort. The work rate has been superb. Very, very organised. Interesting half, just missing goals. So don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil nil. Real Madrid playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half despite this scoreline. Converting chances would make a world of difference for them. Looks to slip it through. The referee's awarded a free kick. Just a talking to, I think. Yes, it is. To the back post. He's dealt with that well. Really didn't have enough to concern the defence. 
Well, they are working very hard to get it wide now, Jim. Yeah, that's that's true. And is that how you're seeing it? Yeah, I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line. It's, uh, it's where the room is. Looks like a good ball through. And you can get that clear. There's going to be a change here. There's a man waiting to come on. forward Azar tries a long pass towards the front out towards the flank oh that's neat Espanyol saved by a gutsy tackle he had to get it right well if ever a tackle had to be made that was about the perfect example they were completely caught out by the break and they got themselves into last resort territory what a saviour. And he has been fouled there. There could be trouble here. And for now, the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. finish now it's a brilliant interception this defense just doesn't trust itself to to play a higher line frighten the people getting in behind yeah absolutely it just opens up the opportunity of not only strikers getting behind but the runners from midfield too Piatti knocks it towards the front and the flag has stayed down Modric pumps it upfield. Good run down the left. What can they make of it? With a delicate ball. Itoraspe tries to get it forward quickly. Pulled forward. What does he try from here? 90 minutes gone and nothing to show. There goes the final whistle. Well, it looked nil-nil from a fair way out. Little craft or guile or penetration. Defences largely untroubled. 